In this video, we are going to test a new version of Square Waffle, a little bit different from the one we discussed in our recent blog on this thread. We have configured this machine in audit-only mode to demonstrate this malware. The initial delivery typically comes as an ARM document like this one, which contains VBS macros that subsequently execute PowerShell to download and launch the loader. As soon as we allow the micro to run, it retrieves the malicious files and a process injection into explorer.exe occurs. And from here, it can download Cobalt Strike or Quadbot. As we can see here, we can identify a number of exploits uh, executed in memory, as well as the payloads that are downloaded for this thread. Let's take a look at how BlackBerry Protect and Optics are able to provide forensic data to aid on investigations. We can identify here the malicious file, and then we can make an introspection and identify a collection of threat indicators showing anomalies, collection capabilities, and how these files are able to delete files and directories and try to deceive the victim into thinking these are legitimate files. On BlackBerry Optics, we can see how DDE is used to execute the payload via the macros contained within the, um, the ARM document. And we can conduct deeper investigation on this issue if we need to. While we can stop this at an early stage with script control, we have turned off that feature to identify if our silence AI models are able to prevent this threat. We enable the macro here. We can see the actual execution and how we can block the execution of these files immediately. Prevention is possible with BlackBerry.